What is up, many guys? I do welcome to my channel. It's your boy, and I'm back again, guys. If you're new, please make sure you subscribe. Let's get to it. So, we have got the Nike Air Max One, they're called the Baltic Blue, and I'll show you in a couple of seconds. And the bam, as you guys can see there, guys. Before I continue, let me just promise you if you haven't, please make sure you hit the thumbs up as well and also like the video as well. I bring quite a lot of shoes on this channel, so any upcoming shoes. I will give you guys any updates in regards to those shoes as well. And we'll also do in-hand reviews as well. So as I was saying, guys, this is the Nike Air Max 1, the Baltic Blue, which is a beautiful shoe, which comes in that cordro form there, which is mostly the Baltic Blue, but you've also got Obsidian Blue on the inside as well as on the outside as well. So you've also got like a tan color as well on the tick on the side as well, and also on the tag on the tongue as you guys shall see in a couple of seconds. So the midsole comes in white, then the outer sole comes in black as well. I do love obsidian blue. It's, I think, my favorite color. So on the front there, you've got blue laces which tie in with the rest of the shoe. I would suggest that you change the laces to a white color or even like a tan color as well. But I'd probably think they'll provide you some extra laces. If they don't, then like just try and break it off a little bit. So um, I've done a video on the... Nike MX1, the animal print that are coming out on Thursday, I believe. Those were for females. And with this one, it's coming out, I think, on Friday. And this is for males, I suspect. It is a very strong male color. You know, males love blue. So that's a good thing. So in terms of uh, the retail price, these will be £153. So resale-wise, I think it will depend on how many units are being produced. And also with the MX ones, they tend to sit as well after they get released as well, which is a good thing because it gives everybody a chance that wants to buy them. I think with this color as well, it's, I think, a color for people that like love MX ones. You've got those aficionados. It's not for everyone. I get that. So for me personally, I think if I was to wear this, I would probably get some um, some vintage midi car hat pants. I'd probably go for like um, a nice gray color. I'd wear like some vintage, um, or either get some dickies. You can get some dickies gray pants with some white socks and then put this on and maybe like wear like a nice blue and white varsity jacket or a nice blue puffer jacket as well and just kind of tie it in as well. Or you can either just wear all denim, wear some denim blue jeans, a denim jacket as well to match, a white top and then put the shoes on as well. You look nice as well. So it gives you different options. So it's a beautiful shoe. I like it, man. Honestly, it's really, really nice. Now, one thing which I'm not sure of is um, the toe box. Like, will it crease? And when it creases, like, you know, there's nothing you can do about it. So if you're going to buy this, I'll suggest that you get some force shields, which you can then put in the shoes to kind of help, you know, the shoes stop creasing so, you know, so much. So I'm going to end the video here. The, I can't even talk about it. I'm going to end the video here, guys. Thanks for watching. Make sure you guys like this video, and I'll see you guys soon. God bless. Much love.